Rule number 46. The comparative can be followed by a qualm, meaning than, and the two things compared must be put into the same case. Let's take a brief break from our ablative case rules and finish up our discussion of the comparative. In rule number 45, I showed you how the ablative of comparison is used to compare two different things. Cato es cicerone eloquentior. Cato is more eloquent than Cicero. But there's another way to show comparison, and that's with the word qualm, which we would regularly translate as than. I don't think I need to note qualm with any color, but we'll mark our two nouns with blue and yellow, and the comparative in salmon red. So let's take this phrase, remove the ablative, and show comparison with qualm. Cato est eloquentior quam cicero. Notice that cato and cicero, the two nouns being compared, are in the same case, the nominative. That's a requirement for using qualm. Tu es calidior quam ego. You are more clever than I. Both tu and ego are in the same case, the nominative. And this brings up an interesting point of English grammar. I bet if I heard this in the hallways of my school, I'd hear than me rather than than I. But the Latin makes it clear that we are comparing words in the same case. Tu and ego, meaning you and I. She loved you more than her own eyes. Te plus quam oculos suos amabat. They prefer reading more than fighting. Malunt legere quam pugnare. Here the verb malunt carries with it the idea of more, magus, with the ma prefix, and we're comparing the two infinitives legere and pugnare. I gave more gifts to my daughter than to my wife. Plura dona filii quam uxori dedi. Here we are comparing the two dative case nouns, filii and uxori. Quam allows us to write a sentence like this, where the words we're comparing are in the dative case. The ablative of comparison is only really used with nouns in the nominative or accusative cases, and we have to use quam when our comparative is in the genitive, dative, or ablative, like here. Senex est meliore condicione quam adulescens. An old man is in a better position than a young man. Meliore is in the ablative case, and so we need to use a qualm here rather than the ablative of comparison. Also, qualm is used pretty regularly with comparative adverbs, as in, the sister works more diligently than her brother. Soror diligentius laborat quam frater. Diligentius is our comparative adverb, so we expect to use qualm here, comparing how the sister works to how her brother works. But of course, poets break all the rules. So we have rule number 46. The comparative can be followed by a qualm, meaning than, and the two things compared must be put into the same case.